You may have noticed that when you are in an organization that already has a SAM assessment for a given uh, group, product, team, or whatever the scope is, uh, and you go into assessments and you want to start a new SAM assessment, SAM does not appear in the drop-down menu because you already have a SAM assessment here. Working offline, you may have the habit of starting a new assess SAM assessment every X amount of time. But in SAMI, this turns into a continuous quality improvement cycle where uh, the previous scores serve as the uh, baseline for the new assessments. So uh, if I go to my assessment and I look for something that is um, assessed and validated, it is now in the improvement track. Let me find one that hasn't been assigned yet. Um, and then the question is asked, do you want to start an improvement process or do you want to complete this stream without improvements? If you're starting the improvement process, you're setting a roadmap for improvement for this uh, security activity. So for both of these streams, then you can set uh, goals as to where you want to get with this by when. If you say, no, this is not necessary at this time, I'm going to complete this stream without improvement. And then uh, I can archive the stream and restart the evaluation, or I can still change my mind and go to an improvement track. This means that this stream now comes back to the beginning of the cycle and is back in evaluation mode with pre-filled out with the scores you had previously. So this is the point where you could do a, a reassessment and you start again from the top. The idea here is that you don't necessarily need to do that for all security activities. Uh, some security activities may be on the long-term roadmap for improvement. Hence, they are kind of parked at the score they currently have until that roadmap is finished and then they come back for reassessment. Meanwhile, if you're assessing, you assess the ones that are ready for reassessment. This you can also follow in the reporting tab where you have the progress of the score of the organization across time, every time something has changed. And that is why you do not create new assessments every time you do an assessment. If you want a workaround, there is a workaround. What you could do is you create, you could create sub, uh, sub scopes of each scope, but it's kind of a dirty workaround. And we recommend that uh, you basically transform SAM into a continuous quality improvement cycle at your organization.